NBC7's What's Up is sponsored by Cox, bringing us closer. I'm NBC7's Marianne Cushy, and this is your morning update for Monday, May 30th. A Memorial Day wreath laying ceremony will be held this morning aboard the USS Midway Museum. For the first time since before the pandemic, the ceremony will be open to the public. This year's event will feature guest speakers, patriotic performances, a moment of silence, a blood drive, and a missing man flyover. A San Diego tradition is back after being put on hold for the past couple of years due to the pandemic. Today, thousands of people will be lining the streets of Kensington for the annual Memorial Day Parade. The theme for this year's parade, Back to the Future, and it begins along Marlboro Avenue at 10 this morning. The parade will feature bands, community groups, and local schools. The parade has been a Memorial Day tradition for more than 30 years years. And as we honor our veterans this Memorial Day, the City of San Diego also closing several locations and services today. All city administration offices will be closed along with rec centers and pools and city libraries. At Bevel Park, all public buildings are closed, but museums and attractions may have holiday schedules. Trash pickup will also be delayed by one day this week. A lot of travelers made their way here this holiday weekend. There is an increase in tourism happening as COVID cases are rising. Last week, the county reported nearly 19,000 new cases. That's 26 times higher than Memorial Day of last year. Restaurants with expanded outdoor patios may have to say goodbye to the extra space. The temporary program that allowed them to create the outdoor dining areas during the pandemic ends on July 13th. Business owners looking to keep their outdoor setups, they'll have to apply for a permit from the city. Those approved will be responsible for annual fees ranging from 10 to $30 per square foot. Businesses that <clears throat> pardon me, do not apply and don't remove their outdoor structures by July 13th will be subject to penalties. And coming up, Ashley with a look at your first alert forecast. Boom! <laughs> Cox Panoramic Wi-Fi works wherever you go at home. And thankfully, wherever they don't, get reliably fast Wi-Fi throughout your home with Cox Panoramic Wi-Fi. Good Monday morning to you. Looks like a really nice day for our Memorial Day. Did want to let you know we are still under a beach hazard statement until tomorrow night. So rip currents are strong. The waves are going to be three to six feet. Uh, so if you are headed to the beach for your Memorial Day, just keep that in mind. Make sure to swim near a lifeguard and keep a close eye on those kids, especially for the next couple of days. Here's your afternoon highs for you at the coast. We should be at low 70s. Little bit of cloud cover this morning, and then it's going to burn off for especially the coast and inland valleys and plenty of sunshine for the afternoon hours. In the valley should be mid to upper 70s for today, mostly sunny skies. Mountains at 69 and breezy. Deserts coming in at 97 and breezy. Marianne? Thanks, Ashley. And don't forget, we can bring you the very latest news right here at NBC7.com and on TV. And you can also learn more on our podcast. That's Today in San Diego, where we talk about the day's biggest headlines in less than five minutes. Stay safe, everybody, and have a nice day.